Blather 96, Great Britain ideas. Great Britain plot ideas. Okay, um... Now, um... Why, 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 Arthur says Jesus, because it's... What, what's going on is that him and, him and Danny and Arthur's imagination are mates. And, uh, it's him and Danny forever. You know, and, uh, Arthur's gotten very used to his flatmate. Likes his company as they go out to the pub and they do things together and he's used to his company and being around chin and was, you know, they smoke together and they talk together and he's very used to the company of Danny and it, it, that's well, that's what's filled the hole in his life in a sense, you know, and because um, he's not really got a woman terribly much and uh, Danny's filled that hole and, and he, he saw it coming with Jessica and, uh, and sort of like, Jesus, you know, the bloke's, the bloke's fallen for a Sheila. In Arthur's sort of imagination, and for Arthur it gets serious, but he, Arthur knows all about love and all that sort of stuff that comes right down to it. But Jesus, because because he sees the writing on the wall, and of the Great Britain two stuff, that's because it's probably a trilogy. And the Great Britain two stuff that that idea as as a flatmates again is developed, and you know where Mates is all he's saying to me, you know, and does she, and I'm not sure she's. She, King of Loser or something like that, he might say, or oh, she's coming, is she? He might say stuff like that. So, um, the, what, the reason why he's saying Jesus is that he's not impressed because he sees the end of his, not really gravy train because he pays his own way, but the end of his, you know, good company is, is coming to an end. So that's, um, that's what's going on there and that's, that's, those ideas have to be worked have to be worked into the plot, the ultimate plot which will come out. And one other thing is that it's, it might not necessarily be an Ed Sheeran concert, but it's just some sort of British uh, pop star who's popular enough at Wembley. At this stage potentially Ed Sheeran, but uh, just someone who's popular enough and represents British sort of British pop icon well enough. Uh, 